welcome to a new vlog so i know i haven't posted since like what january february i don't know but i've actually been vlogging for months but i never have the time to sit down and actually edit the videos so i was like you know what let me just start off fresh and restart all the vlogging and just actually make time for it this weekend to edit it so yeah just a little update on what's been going on i've had a lot going on which is also why i haven't been vlogging my dogs got sick and they literally almost died and yeah that's kind of been like occupying me a lot and worrying me a lot so that's why i haven't like also haven't vlogged because i haven't been doing anything except staying home taking care of my dogs don't mind me i don't, I don't have nails right now i took off my nails because i broke one of them and i was like you know what? i'm taking off all my nails but I think I'm gonna do my own nails this weekend maybe we'll see but anyways yeah so another little update I'm moving out to like LA area not LA exactly it's like well LA's like huge there's a lot of little towns and cities right next to it and inside of it but I'm not gonna say where but I'm moving down to this area I'm moving out of Bakersfield and down to this LA area and yeah today i'm gonna take you guys along i'm gonna be touring some apartments i don't think i'll be talking while i'm touring them just because some like i'm gonna have like a person like they're touring it so i'll probably just take a video of it and do like a voiceover or whatever but yeah today i'm touring three apartments so that'll be really fun and then friday today's wednesday and then friday i'm gonna go to disney so I'll probably vlog a little bit of that too as much as I can but yeah the reason why I am moving is because you know like I go to I don't know if I mentioned it in my personally vlog but I go to school here I go to Pepperdine and they have um that I don't go to the main Malibu campus because that's for undergrad I since my program is a graduate program a master's program I have to do the evening format which they have other campuses around Southern California so they have one in Calabasas one in West LA and one in Irvine so I go to those I go to those three campuses for school but yeah that's why I'm moving here because I go to school here and then I'm gonna try to find a job out here and I have to also think about like my internships when I do they call it practicum but they're technically internships but yeah I'm gonna do my practicum here they have a list of like um like places you have to do your practicum at so that's also why i need to move here because i need to be close to where i need to do my practicum but yeah let's go ahead and get inside and start touring the apartment i'm so excited hopefully it's cute i really hope it's not ugly please don't be ugly but we'll see okay, so i completely forgot to take a video while i was in the apartment but it was all right the inside of it was actually pretty nice it was pretty like bathroom was very much newly remodeled the bathroom was really nice the rest of it the flooring was newly like it looked brand new so that was really nice just the kitchen looked like you know how they say the landlord special it was just the cabinets were painted over and it was thick paint and then the bedroom as well they have like a whole wall it's just closet space and drawers and stuff and cabinetry like built-ins and that one also the the level special landlord special um it was basically just like painted over with pretty thick paint but overall i still liked it the only thing i don't like is that you have to park on the street they do have garages there but like they're already rented out and he said somebody might be like moving out soon and they won't need that garage space anymore so i'm like if i get the garage maybe i'll get the apartment but i don't i don't know i don't it's in a pretty busy area and parking isn't the best there's no homeless here i did not see a single homeless person here which makes me feel better about it like a little, a little bit safer the area is pretty cool like it's not like super like nice but it's not like ghetto either and that was my thing i was like i don't want to live anywhere ghetto because i'm a woman living by myself and it's just not safe for a woman living by herself to live somewhere where it's like dangerous not only that but i'm a little bougie now but yeah it's not like a super super bougie area but it's not like super bad either so it's a pretty like all right like i feel safe enough here but yeah it's just the whole parking situation it's not it so i don't this isn't on my list of like the top ones i want to get just because like i said it's not the parking is horrible and i do not want to struggle with parking i don't want to park far and have to walk back in and what if i have groceries and i have to park far not only that but parking is i believe it's only across the street i don't think on the street the apartment is at i don't think there's parking right there so i will have to cross a busy street to get to the apartment and i don't like that because i'm like if i have groceries if i'm if i have like stuff i was shopping for like it's just it's just a big hassle and i don't want to deal with it not only that but get this this i'll tell you the best part for last 
parking garage just for the parking garage you also have to pay on top of that it's 150 dollars on top of the rent you're already paying for and that is just absolutely ridiculous like i'm paying all this much for rent plus i have to pay for parking like no because there's this other apartment that i really 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 liked um and that was like my number one top priority where i want to move to but it's a little more pricey but considering the fact that if i lived here and i'd have to pay extra for parking like that much extra then i'm like i may as well just live in the other complex i really liked not only that but there's pet rent the only good thing though is um he was like um uh, regarding pets he asked me what kind of dogs i have i'm guessing they don't want big dogs there because i because he was like oh if they're small dogs like the landlords usually fine with it so he asked me what kind of dog i have and i have i have two little pomeranians so they're really small he's like oh yeah just send me a picture and 90 percent chance the landlord's gonna let you go through with it with the dogs and then another good thing about that is that he's like if he does allow those dogs he's probably just gonna charge you for one dog he's not gonna charge you for both dogs he did say pet rent was 50 to 100 dollars, so my guess is they're gonna be like we'll charge you for only one dog but the one dog is like 100 dollars. it's just that's a lot of money for dogs these bitches don't work like why are they paying pet rent these bitches are lazy all they do is eat sleep and shit like that's it I don't get it i'm just like weighing my options because i'm like if i'm paying this much here like with all the stuff adding up on top of like bills and stuff like i'm like i may as well get the one i really really wanted even though it's a little pricier but they charge less for like those extra cost fees or whatever like for oh, I, fucking, I forgot to ask him about the deposit yeah the other apartment i wanted it's literally only a hundred dollar difference i have another one at 145 it's 11 21 right now so i have another one at 145 and then i have another one at five o'clock so right now i'm gonna drive to the beach just to see it because i have time to kill and then i'll drive to the next complex and then after that i'll go grab a bite to eat because i'm starving and then i'll go to the next complex and then i'll go to school obviously. so since i'm touring apartments over here the apartments that i'm touring are super close to the beach they're like eight minutes away so I was like, let me go hang out at the beach for a little bit just because, you know, to see the area, to get a fill of the beach and just because I can. Because that's the point of me, like, moving near the beach to come more often. Of course, though, it was also money-wise because the apartments I found in this area just so happen to be cheaper. But I love the fact that it's really close to the beach because it's always been my dream to, like, live near a beach. Yeah, so this beach is kind of, like, Maybe because it's gloomy out, I'm not liking it. Like, I don't like the water. The water does not look fun to swim in. Oh my God, I saw an animal. I think it was a seal. I think I just saw a seal. It might've been, I don't think it was a dolphin. I'm pretty sure it was a seal. This is so cool. I saw it again. Let me see if, let me see if you guys can see the little animal. I'm trying to see if I can catch him. Or her, you know, who knows, but it was over there. I got distracted by a little seal. Hopefully I see it again and I can actually take a video of it but oh i was gonna tell you guys about the beach so it doesn't it has like a little like water slide playground area thing like in the water which looks super fun but i'm like maybe because it's gloomy out the water doesn't look like doesn't look like the water i would want to swim in but this beach will, this beach will be this beach. this beach will be super cool to like bring my dogs here walk my dogs here just sit on the sand chill out i don't i feel like i would rather go to a beach more down south like huntington beach just because the 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 beach there actually is really nice but i'm gonna walk back but so far so good oh so guess who went on another apartment tour and didn't film it me i know i am so sorry it's just i fell in love with the place so much and i just got distracted and i completely forgot to start filming and then i was talking to the guy um he actually toured an apartment with me like a month or two ago somewhere else and it was pretty nice the other place but i was just like unsure about it but this one, oh my god, this is fucking nice. Like, it is really, really newly remodeled. The lighting is, like, such an important thing for me. Because, A, I want to be able to take selfies inside of my apartment. I have good lighting. B, I get very depressed when I don't have sunlight. Like, in my room, in the daytime, my blinds are usually always open because I need sunlight. If I don't have sunlight, I get even more depressed. So, that one had a lot of windows. I think I had a window in the kitchen. It had, like, two windows in the living room. I had one huge window in the bedroom and yeah i fell in love with it i'm gonna apply to this one and i am so excited but i'm still gonna view my other the other apartment maybe i'll um 
let's fingers crossed i actually vlog it this time because your girl's just been slacking but i mean if i do end up getting this apartment and get approved for it then in that case i'll probably do like an empty apartment tour you guys could see that but yeah i hope you guys don't get bored of me talking i talk a lot i hope you guys i've just been talking this whole time like i haven't even like shown you guys stuff so hopefully you guys like hearing me talk you know yeah anyways i'm gonna go inside of a cafe and get a coffee get like a little snack because I, I hopefully they have salads i'm really craving a salad and i'm so thirsty so i'll get like a coffee or maybe like i'm so freaking thirsty like i'm low-key thinking about getting coffee and like an iced drink but we'll see i want to mention also another thing i really like about this area is there's like no traffic i there's like barely any cars out here like if any so this place is a lot less busy and i love that it's a lot less busy and the only bad part is i've seen a couple homeless people like maybe three or four around the area which isn't the best but the place is gated so it makes me feel safer about it you know So I came to a cute little coffee shop and it is so cute. They decorated it all nice. It's giving Mexico vibes just because the flooring is like, this is the type of flooring you would, like your grandma would have in Mexico, you know? I mean, my grandma didn't have this type of flooring. They got a different type of flooring. But that's what I imagine. Or like an hacienda would have like this type of flooring or like an older house in Mexico. Maybe I'm getting those vibes because of the music. They're playing Spanish music. So maybe that's why. And then there's like a concrete wall. Oh no, it's very cute so cute but i'm gonna do some job applications so i sit down because if a bitch wants her nice apartment a bitch has to fill our job applications so i wanted to show you guys what i ended up getting i ended up getting an iced tea and it is so it's so good it's so refreshing and then i got a coffee i haven't tried this coffee so we'll see that's good it's a vibe it's a vibe yo this apartment had roaches y'all see those two little dots on the floor there's actually three dead roaches i didn't zoom into the other roach but it was so disgusting and it wasn't even clean and this apartment would have been so freaking cute if it was clean and didn't have roaches and it was a two bedroom and the lighting was great but the roaches i was just like absolutely not and oh my god it stank like straight up cigarettes the second i walked in there i got slapped with cigarette smell okay so i just finished trying the last one of the day and fuck no <laughs> it was so bad it kind of sucks hold on let me let me it was horrendous it was such a shame because like the apartment itself was really cute like the setup of it the rooms the doors huge closets but I saw two dead roaches on the floor. I'm pretty sure three. It wasn't even cleaned. Like I saw dirtiness inside of it. I can't. It was, it's a definite no for me. I don't want to have roaches as roommates. Thank you very much. It was, I hate the fact that this apartment was the only one I took a video in because of the fact that I was so disappointed. I wish I would have taken a video of the other two because the other two were pretty cute the second one like absolutely i want it so bad the first one was cute i just like the second one more but this one held to the note absolutely not oh my god see i see in my in my rear view mirror there's just a guy like standing in the corner looking around like looking sketchy i think he might be on drugs oh my god i can't do this this is horrendous i gotta go i'm gonna go to school I'm gonna drive back around. I have school at seven, so I have enough time. So I'm gonna drive again past the place I saw earlier. Uh, the second one that I really, really like, just to get a bit more of a feel for the like neighborhood. Mm -hmm.